Hello everybody and happy new year! Oh my god, it's 2019! Not yet for me though. But when you watch this, it's gonna be 2019. So, welcome 2019! Surprise me! <laughs> so when my channel was only in Spanish, I used to make this movie reviews, although I don't know anything about cinematography or anything at all, you know, I would just talk about a movie if I liked it. I decided that of course Mary Poppins Returns needed a review, okay? It just... It, this movie was amazing. Every single second of this movie was perfect. As I said, I don't know much about casting or cinematography or anything, but these are my thoughts and I feel and think that this movie was just perfect in every every single way. Now, I'm a big Julie Andrews fan, so I wasn't very sure about Emily Blunt as Mary Poppins. I know she's a great actress and singer, but I just wasn't, you know, in there. But she was also absolutely fantastic. But I read somewhere that she read all of the Mary Poppins books and that she was gonna bring, you know, like the true Mary, Pop Mary Poppins self or something. And, you know, I was. And Lynn Manuel Miranda was just brilliant. The songs, the scenes, the acting. I do believe everything was just perfect. I totally expected a Julie Andrews cameo because. Mary Poppins, hello! So I was a little disappointed there. I love Meryl Streep too, I love Meryl Streep. So seeing her there in such a weird makeup and accent, I just... I love her. And Dick Van Dyke, can we just take a second? That man is like 93 years old, right? How? How? I'm pretty sure that if my grandpa was alive, he would be just like that. He would have that much energy and, you know, like physical strength, I guess. I, I, I am 27 years old and I wouldn't be able to dance the way he did. I'm sorry if this is a spoiler. I mean, we all already know that he was in the movie, so obviously he was going to dance, right? I, I, uh, I don't know how this man do these things. And he said he had arthritis. I don't have shit, I think. I can't move like that. He, <sighs> Mister, you are an angel. You are a treasure to the planet. You are a treasure to the universe, okay? We must treasure his soul. His entire being, okay? I tried to make a favorite song, but I couldn't. I, co I couldn't. All of the songs were so beautiful. Although, Every time I'm feeling down, which is a lot if you know me, <laughs> I'm gonna be listening to Lin Manuel telling me to trip a little like fantastic with him. You know? Thank you so much for that song, Mr. Nobody like I can't I can't imagine anyone better than you for this for this character and this songs, okay? Like, <laughs> I just love that man, okay? He's just a fucking treasure to the planet. Can I get an amen? I went alone to watch this movie because I'm forever alone. What's new? And behind me there were these two couples. Married couples, I guess, because they were old. You know? <laughs> they were geeking out about the movie so much. I just loved them. I was, I was, I was trying to pay attention to the movie, but they were geeking out. I was like, yes! I, of course, cried. Because again, what's new? So you can imagine a grown-ass woman by herself at the movies just sobbing into her handkerchief. Not cute. I think they didn't miss anything, honestly. Like, every single thing. They could have, like, oh my god. I don't want to throw any spoilers, okay? So I'm, I'm, I'm holding back. I didn't think they missed anything from the first movie because I watched the first movie last night right after i came back because i had to watch it again i was like bitch i need to i need to watch it again so so i seriously feel like they didn't miss anything they 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 were so perfect except and spoiler alert take your headphones off and just wait for me to give you the sign of um this is gonna be the sign okay take your headphones off if you haven't seen the movie 
or don't if you don't plan to watch the movie or if you already watched it, okay? Take them off. I'll do the sign after I finish. What happened to the ball? Did it get fixed? Because they dropped it off at Topsy's. Topsy, that's her name, right? I never picked it up. I don't know if it was fixed. I need to know that. Okay, now, spoiler off. Spoiler off. Anyways, if you haven't seen the movie, do yourself a favor and go watch it because it was amazing. Unless you don't like musicals because, <clears throat> and I hate this kind of people, there were people complaining because they were singing too much. Bitch, have you seen Mary Poppins? Don't you know that this is a fucking musical? Why would you go to a musical if you don't like musicals, goddammit? Or people were on their phones and I was like, bitch, this is an emotional moment. What are you doing on your phone? Like, who cares whatever Pedro is telling you over WhatsApp? Turn that shit off. I turn my phone off when I go to the movies. First, because I want to save battery. My battery is it's bad. So I have to turn my phone off to save battery so I can turn it back on when I'm finished to ask my mom to pick me up because I don't have a car. But yeah, if you don't like musicals, this is definitely not the movie for you. But if you don't like musicals and like Mary Poppins, then you're definitely gonna enjoy this Mary Poppins Returns because it was, it was perfect, you guys. I can't stop thinking about it. I can't stop thinking about Triple Little Life Fantastic, okay? I'm like, <laughs> And because I watched the movie again last night, the, the original, the classic one, the first one, I've been singing all day. Toppins back, toppins, toppins, all day. I can't get it off my head. That and, and Triple Little Life Fantastic and Nowhere to Go But Up. It's, I, I can't get them off my head. But anyways, I know this is like a short review because I don't really know how to do reviews. Honestly, I just share my opinion on things and because I can't really say anything spoilery, I have to make it short and so, well, the video came out short, whatever. But thank you so much for watching this video and I hope that you guys watched the movie. If you already did, please let me know in the comments how much you love Lee Manuel Miranda, okay? Because he's an angel and I'm, I'm never, ever going to get over Dick Van Dyke. I can't. I can't. I can't. Can't. And as always, I'm Zamiya and I'll see you in my next video. I am Peter Pan. I'll never be a man. If you never want to grow, take my hand. I'll take you to Neverland.